Hey guys, Lawrence here and this is my Microsoft Surface Pro 3. As you can see, it's like super small and light and portable. So when I had to run a bunch of VMs for school, I had to run them on this thing, which obviously I can't do. Now, the next logical step would to just be run it on the Ryzen system over there would be awesome and then just RDP into it, which I do. But there was a problem. You see, my school would not allow it. Uh, they basically monitor all your traffic and that's the same with a lot of public Wi-Fi hotspots. So I was looking for a VPN. Now I could just run my own VPN server, but I was also looking at what's available on the internet because for a lot of people, that's actually a more usable um, product than running their own VPN server. Now I did try a bunch of different services. Some of them were free, but had horrible data caps. Uh, some like TunnelBear actually were pretty good, but they wouldn't let me get past the VPN block at my school. So I still couldn't use it at school, which is where I wanted to use it. So in the end, I ended up with Windscribe, which is a fairly new VPN service. And they also have a few other things. Now Windscribe is a free VPN and ad block service. So at the moment you can just add a little extension in Chrome, which will turn it into an ad blocker. By the way, guys, whitelist this channel. And what you can also do is run the VPN service on your computer and it will create a virtual um, network card, a wired one, but virtual, um, at which point you can bypass everything. Now, what's awesome is their value. So even with a free basic account, you get 10 gigabytes a month. And if you just tweet out to them, you'll get 15, which is awesome. Way more than what TunnelBear, for example, offers, actually 30 times more than what TunnelBear offers. So that's really nice of them. But then to actually get unlimited bandwidth, you can go to the pro or the business model. Now the pro license comes in at 379 a month, which let's be honest is pretty damn cheap. But if you like me are way too cheap to get a cheap service, you can also go all the way to the bottom of the page where it says mine for upgrade. So you can dedicate your CPU to mine some Monero and then Windscribe will pay your uh, VPN subscription with those Monero hashes that you've been you know, mining for them. Now, the price at the moment is 50 million hashes, which to mine in my case with my Ryzen system took about four and a half days because I get around 150 hashes a second. Uh, if I were to mine on this thing, it would take way longer. Um, but you know, you can just let it mine at night and then when you're gonna play video games, you just close it. So that's really awesome. And I really just wanted to talk to you guys about the service because I need it cheap or free preferably and stable and high performance. So cheap, I already covered that. Now performance, really good actually. So you can see um, the ping is slightly increased, but the throughput is just, I mean, it's pretty damn good for a VPN service, isn't it? Stability is obviously also really important. So while it can take a little bit of time sometimes to uh, establish a connection, once you have a connection, it's rock solid. So thumbs up to Windscribe for that. Uh, my school and its Wi-Fi network blocks the usual VPN ports. So having the ability to tunnel all your traffic through other ports, again, awesome because it actually enables me to run a VPN and then contact my desktop PC over a VPN through RDP and I can then access my VMs at school. That's the whole point of using Windscribe to me. Now for the record, this is not a paid promotion, but I will put an affiliate link below. Um, what you can also do is create secure links. Um, I haven't actually tried those out. I don't care about them. I just want, you know, a secure VPN and I got that with Windscribe and I hope that you guys can Maybe use it as well. Let me know in the comments if you like this one. If you have an even better VPN service, uh, please let me know so I can check that one out as well. But for now, thank you very much for watching. Massive thanks to our new Patreons. Um, if you want to become one of the Patreons, again, link is in the description, along with an Instagram and a Twitter link. But thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe to the channel and I'll see you guys in the next one. Hopefully, if it finally works that router. I'm still struggling a lot.